Welcome once again to Commander by Dana. Today we continue Patreon week. We're doing all five Patreon sponsored videos this week, which means we'll have a new video every day of the week. Today's video was brought to us by patron supporter Nick. Nick requested we do a video on the new Orzhov legendary zombie, Ratadrabic of Urborg. Before we get started, I'd like to quickly ask you to like and subscribe. I've been very happy with the growth this channel has had so far, and I'm excited to see where we're going. If you're looking for ways to support the channel directly, you can head on over to patreon.com slash One of the tiers is specifically set up for Commander. For only $25, I will build you a custom Commander deck based around your specifications, and even do a deck video on it. With that out of the way, let's get into the video. Ratadrapic of Urborg is a 4-mana 3-3 legendary zombie wizard with Vigilance and Ward 2. He also gives all zombies we control Vigilance. Additionally, and the part that makes everyone excited, whenever a creature we control dies, we create a token that's a copy of that creature, except it's not legendary, and it's a 2-2 black zombie in addition to its other colors and types. Now, Nick asked that the deck's budget stay under $200 and be on the stronger side of casual. Not a strong deck, but around a 6 or so on the power scaling. He also wanted the theme to be Legends Matter. While brainstorming ideas for how to build this deck, I hit upon an interesting one. I discussed it with Nick and he agreed this would be a fun concept. But before we get into the deck list, we should keep in mind our checklist. 50 mana sources, usually split between 37 lands and 13 pieces of ramp. 10 pieces of card advantage. 8 to 10 pieces of spot removal. 2 to 3 board wipes. 2 pieces of graveyard hate. And 1 sudden I win card. Ratadrabic of Urborg turns all of our dead creatures into 2-2 two -two zombies. So obviously this will be an aristocrats deck, right? Not this time, gentle viewer. Instead, the goal of this deck is to give Ratadrabic indestructible and then drop a board wipe or two. All of our creatures come back as zombies and our opponents are left with nothing. To protect our commander from our own wraths, we've got Timely Ward, Shielded by Faith, Dark Steel Plate, and Hammer of Nizam. We're also running Swift Foot Boots to help protect our commander from spot removal. Our board wipes consist of Dam, Wrath of God, Phyrexian Scriptures, Austere Command, Vanquish the Horde, and Blood Money. I know that Blood Money is 7 mana, but if we cast it, it should give us enough treasures to turn around and cast Primeval's Glorious Rebirth. For more reanimation, we're running Victimize, Unburial Rites, Ravos Soul Tender, and Liliana Death's Majesty. I know that some people don't consider reanimation to be card advantage, but it is. For tutors, we've got Varagoth Bloodsky Sire and Sidisi Undead Vizier. The rest of our card draw consists of Sign in Blood, Siphon Mind, Greed, Rankle Master of Pranks, and God Eternal Bontu. For interaction, we've got Swords to Plowshares, Disenchant, D Spark, Vanishing Verse, Fracture, Mortify, Generous Gift, Utter End, and Zat's Will, our first piece of Graveyard Hate. Our ramp consists of Soul Ring, Wayfarer's Bauble, Arcane Signet, Marble Diamond, Charcoal Diamond, Talisman of Hierarchy, Orzhov Signet, Mind Stone, Felwar Stone, Sword of the Animist, Decanter of Endless Water, Worn Power Stone, and Solemn Simulacrum. Our lands consist of Command Tower, Exotic Orchard, Isolated Chapel, Tainted Field, Caves of Koilos, Snowfield Sinkhole, Sunlit Marsh, Temple of Silence, Goldmire Bridge, Orzhov Guildgate, Black Dragon Gate, Citadel Gate, Silver Quill Campus, Scoured Barrens, Forsaken Sanctuary, Vault of the Archangel, Bajuka Bog is our second piece of Graveyard Hate, Myriad Landscape for additional ramp, Evolving Wilds and Terramorphic Expanse for color fixing, Eight Plains, and Nine Swamps. Since Nick requested that this deck be a Legends Matter deck with token doubling, we'll start there. Anointed Procession is an amazing magic card, 
and hasn't had a reprint yet outside of being a list card, so I recommend picking it up sooner rather than later. The rest of our legendary creatures consist of Elias Ilkor, Sadistic Pilgrim, Drana, Liberator of Malakir, Kambal, Consul of Allocation, Thalia, Heretic Cathar, Vito, Thorn of the Dusk Rose, Gaunti, Lord of Luxury, Audric, Master Tactician, Eo, the Sky Dawn, God Eternal Oketra, Junji, the Midnight Sky, Laisa, Forgotten Archangel, Shadrick, Silver Quill, Thalise, Reverend Medium, Astarion, the Decadent, Kokusho, the Evening Star, Obnixilis, Unshackled, and Yose, the Morning Star. So let's take a look at our deck and compare it to our checklist. 50 mana sources split between 37 lands and 13 pieces of ramp. Right on target. 12 pieces of card advantage, counting tutors and recursion. 9 pieces of spot removal. 6 board wipes. 2 pieces of graveyard hate. No sudden eye win cards, but with all of our board wipes, we don't really need one. I know that the temptation is to tutor for anointed procession to double Radadravic's triggers, but we really need to get a way to make him indestructible first. That takes priority over doubling our tokens. We make Radadravic indestructible, blow up the board, get a bunch of zombies with awesome abilities, and beat our opponents to death. I know I could have gone the aristocrats path with this deck, but this seemed a lot more fun to me. How are you building Radadravic of Urborg? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for tuning in. Once again, a huge shout out to my editor Cute Stuff. I couldn't make these videos without her. If you'd like to hire her to edit your own videos, there's a link to her Fiverr page below. I also wanted to give a quick shout out to all of my patrons, Jiraiya, Waffles, Muffins, Casey, Danny, Nick, Marcus, Black Dragon, and Phoenix of Ice. You guys are awesome. I post new Commander Deck videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, or you can click here to watch additional videos. Also, if you're a fan of anime and manga like I am, feel free to check out my other channel, Musings by Danon. Again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all again next time on Commander by Danon.